Hello everybody, I've got some very exciting news. On Frankfurt Station Lofts, we've just updated our numbers and our projected return now is 28.7% average annual return. When we go in there, we analyze properties before we take them over and we, we try and be conservative on all our numbers. And part of this one, because it is a lease up, we had to do a 12 month budget to say what we're, we think we're gonna do as far as leasing up every month on how many new leases we get, which will transfer into more money and better cash flow, et cetera. So what we did is we have now been managing the property for a month, for one month. Now I was budgeting the first month, zero new leases. I was budgeting the next month, 10 new leases. The month after that, getting into leasing season at 20 new leases a month. However, our team has been doing so great that in the first month we were there, we've got 51 new leases. That is taking us up, our occupancy up to 67% from 41 when we took over. So because of that, we have now adjusted our numbers based on this new reality of how many leases we've gotten this first month. So we budgeted zero month one, we actually got 51. Month two, we were budgeting only about 10. Well, now we put month two at 20 leases and the month after that at 20 leases. So we are going to be we are going to be over 90% by the time we hit the end of June. So because of that, all of our numbers change. They all get better. So our income numbers are way up because of that. Our projected income numbers are way up. Now I even lowered, I lowered our other income numbers. It was at $150 per unit per month. I actually lowered the other income to $120 per unit per month, which is 118 of that, $118 per month, is just the internet and technology package that we have on that property for each occupied unit. Now, other income does not include any of our garages, any of our storage units, any of our covered parking. So we're sandbagging our other income numbers still right now, and it's project projected at a 28.7% average annual return. I did lower the exit cap rate uh, slightly, because going in right now, it would be about a 4% cap, maybe a little bit lower if it were stabilized today. So what I did is I put that at 4.5 in year three and 4.7 in year five. So I think we're still conservative on those exit cap rate numbers, but because of the other income, because of the amount of leases we've been getting, our projected income is even better, which makes our returns so much better. So this is a great opportunity to go ahead and invest. It's a class A property, it's brand new. We're buying it at $37 million leased up. I think it's worth at least 42, probably more. So there's some value add component to a class A deal, which is absolutely unheard of. And we would love to have you invest with us. It is a great deal. Love to partner with you. Take care.